Hey, 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 hey. Okay, big tag. Let me give y'all y'all guns. And y'all can give up the other guns. And get the pinging people and pulling people up. Stacks 280. We still programming. Hey, that video right there is him going live with his face busted up. I just pant. Uh, yeah. We, we, we got that. We got that. Yeah. yeah, man, we still programming. <laughs> I just got the lowdown from SETI, man. Well, I I talk I talked to ODM Slim. Well, I got tech ODM Slim. You know? So it's not a oh I ping fluff. Make sure fluff come up. <laughs> this is a perfect time to, to, see, to see if we got the same stories. I, oh, yo, 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 do things. Is it related to the title we was just talking about? No. Um, we finna forget to it. I don't know. I, <laughs> all I know, I, I trust what Slim told me, and what they said is he's still in good, good standing. So. <laughs> That's all that really matter. Nigga, niggas get DP'd all the time. Niggas still program time. Oh, they go that. ODM right there. That's a yeah, fact. Pull them up. Salute. Niggas get DP. That's something these little niggas don't know about. So whatever, whatever it was, he's still good with his within his people. He ain't did no foul shit. They handled what that, they did, and we still that support. That nigga still good with me. Pull up, that nigga pull up good with me. You heard? <laughs> Yeah, pull up glasses, low. Oh yeah, pull up glasses. I'm looking low. for him. I'm looking for him. That's I got him. him. That's the bro. That's glasses, Malone. Yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, glasses. Follow. I need. Glasses? I need that follow back, man. Hey, don't be pressing my nigga. Don't be pressing my nigga. He really with He just shit. followed me. Shut up, Lamonte. <laughs> <laughs> I just shot you a follow too, glasses. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Salute, just follow salute. All the, if you're new follow to the room, this is UOD. Follow the mods. Follow the house up top. You know what it is. Word. We got mixed emotions glasses. in the room. Salute. 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 That's just, it's, it's what it is. All right, make sure y'all make sure that y'all uh y'all seeing in the bottom. If any of the ODM dudes come, pull them up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we here in the UOD, Crip Mac DP. So what? We still programming. You know what I'm saying? So what people speculating if he got put on. If he got DP, I talked to the ODM boys. They told me it was a DP. Uh, they confirmed that. I guess the video at the top, if you look at it, a confirm. You know what I'm saying? It was sufficient. The homies really went there. With them. So that means it was serious. What it was about don't really matter to me. That's five five neighborhood crib business. You know what I'm saying? Niggas, niggas, niggas even though they a small hood, they got rules and regulations. And if, if you feel that you violated that, they gonna hold you accountable. So I know a lot of you young kids don't like responsibility and accountability and all of that shit. Nigga ain't gonna do this. Think you bigger than the program? Well, uh, don't don't join the gang, man, because nigga, that's something that that comes with the territory. Nigga took that and that program. Now what? What's up? LV, what did you hear, bro? Yeah, I was in um, <clears throat> Eban's room, 
and there's a YouTuber I'm familiar with. His name is Seti. And um, he was saying that it, I, I guess people didn't um, appreciate the fact that uh, C-Mac was seen in the past with uh, different sets with different flags. No, this is what that's it was. What it, my, that's I'm, that's I'm, what I'm I heard from Seti. I'm going to set it straight. I'm going to set it straight. What it is is niggas don't, niggas, we don't, first of all, we, 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 we as niggas, we don't, we don't know how to communicate, first of all. So when the issue come up, instead of we us trying to talk and see where we stand at it, nigga, we start squabbling, simple and plain. And then we talk later. That's what happened, right. nigga, because the issue was really keep 1,000 could have been squashed, but we come aggressively, they come aggressively, you know what I'm saying? That's what we do. We, you know what I'm saying, nigga, this is squabble. And simple and plain, that's what happened. Uh, and so not even DP. Just the DP and blow up, then you know what I'm saying? Because it, it, was, it was like, come on, we're going to DP me, nigga? Let's, do, let's go. You feel me? Like it was like that. Nigga, I think it was talking on DP and let's just get it out the way then. And come on. So it was right. like, you feel me? Niggas keep talking about it, let's just do it then. Fuck it. It was like that's no talk, nigga. Fuck it, you know? Shit, we talked about it shit last night. And right So it was over the Facebook shit? Stuff. It was over a lot of shit, bro. We, we, we got a lot of shit going on, period. Niggas we having hidden animosity with cuz, period, bro. You feel me? That just what niggas were getting money, period, and you had hidden animosity. So it's about a lot of shit, you feel me? And they just certain shit set shit off, period. Certain shit, you know what I'm saying, gonna set it off, you feel me on hood. So when they go ahead, they just keep talking about it. Yo, we don't, we don't, we don't have to. But I'm a communicator, so I'm like, you know, what I'm saying we are gonna get it out the way. You know what I'm saying, and we gotta squabble, we gonna squabble. But a lot of niggas, we don't, we don't know how to do that, bro. So it's like, I don't give a fuck what you saying. You don't give a fuck what I'm saying. So nigga, you gonna deep, you gonna DP me, nigga? I'm gonna take off. They, you know, what I'm saying that we start, everybody squabbling now. And it's simple and plain. That's what happened. We all squabbling. Yeah. All right. All right. Now they're straight back to program. You in the matrix. Your ODM is it a situation where it's good now? It's a one and done. Oh no, situation. listen, we, oh, bro, it could have been good for the jump, bro. It didn't have to, you know what I'm saying? Also, bro, shit, just us being who we what type of niggas we is, we niggas aggressive. You feel me? Niggas is aggressive niggas. We from South Street, Los Angeles, bro, and niggas know how, you know what I'm saying? That's what it is. And we don't know how to like. You feel me? Certain niggas be already mad. So it's like, already been mad at you, nigga. We already want to get down anyway, nigga. So, nigga, let's get down. On some real shit. Then, you feel me? It's just like that. But he, he always good in the hood, bro. Like, keep 1,000, nigga. He, it's not a man. Look, he good in the hood. Because that, that type of shit, I ain't gonna lie. It's been, we got niggas that been from different hoods, bro. That go, come on, Hoover, or Brims, all type of shit. That came to the hood, vice versa. So, nigga, that's, that comes with this shit. Dead homies. Right. So that's not even a, even a pro issue. Dead homies. Right. Well, we definitely got it got it real from ODM Slim. That's the real. So all this shit he got put off and all that shit, we ain't hear none of that. Nigga, he's still programming. It's another day. You know what I'm saying? That's how shit go. Another day in South Central LA. What's that cup <laughs> Matrix. Look, in the matrix. You in the matrix. Pull up S Lope. That's like boom. So it's like off. You bit everything. I just pulled up S Lope. Yes, good sir. looking, good looking, family. Yes, sir. Well, like like uh Deuce was saying, man, y'all heard it from ODM Slim Mouth. You know what I mean? It, it doesn't get any more valid than that right there. Um the issue could have been squashed beforehand, but obviously it's a oh, cultural yeah. thing. Sometimes you're gonna have to crash oh. helmets like like oh. you did with your brothers and they talk about it afterwards. Hey, 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 hey they said the uh that nigga uh milk, whatever that nigga name seven four, they said he running from his face. Oh, this shit is funny. This nigga, me, bro. bro. This, I love, I'm gonna tell you about this. this yeah, I see me I see somebody crazy, cloud bro. chasing right now. Somebody just put up the same video of Crip Mac with his face busted up talking about some he got beat up by milk. Man, come on, bro. That's man, just crazy. I, I put up. Man, the that's video. what they gonna do, I'll man. That shit lame as hell. I put up the video uh, 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 of of the Hoovers themselves <laughs> saying that that nigga don't even come around. That no nigga, you got even know where that nigga. He interviews some Hoover niggas, bro. He interviews some Hoover niggas from posting from his hood, and he like, oh, he like, when the last time I seen you? He like looking at me like, what the fuck? Like, he like, man, that was so long ago. Nigga, they never seen nigga in his life. Nigga, I'm a dead homie. You can't tell me like, like, who are you, nigga? Like, you trying to make like you good around here? Yeah. This shit crazy to me, bro. In the game, like this shit, nigga, this, they making this shit like on some. 
TV shit, bro. Like this shit is crazy. This shit don't, it don't make no sense to me no more. Even with bro, like, you know, we like we recording ourselves at the DPS now. This shit crazy, bro. I don't get it, man. But I see it's all a part of you know niggas. I get their money. How they get their money, man. Oh no, cloud crazy. Crazy. I said, I'm advising that dude check that. He don't exactly. just can't do shit himself. He want to do shit. I tell him that's the dumb as fuck. He don't give a fuck. That's him. He want niggas. That's that's him. You're thirteen. You want to see what's going on, nigga? Nigga, you think I'm I'm running for something? Nigga, I'm gonna go get it. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, 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 he he probably just you know he started got to protect that bag, man. But you know, nigga, come from really the grid of this shit. And it's like I ain't never. Yeah, I, I ain't never seen. I, I, this I, shit I ain't never bro. seen before. This is like you know what I'm saying. Come on, yeah, real shit, bro. That's real shit. I'm there. Me, I'm but, but 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 uh, long story short, that nigga showed up and he and he went his rounds. That nigga milk. Nobody can even find Waldo. Like n niggas don't even know where this nigga. Like they don't even know who this nigga is. Yeah, niggas know where he is. Tell that nigga, 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 Oh me! Once, once you start seeing that, you know, once you see what niggas on and what type, what Tony on, yeah, yeah, these niggas be all in the back. You come, bro. These niggas be all in the back. Oh, oh, it's all about the money. It's all about the bag. We just gonna go back and forth. My nigga, I ain't going for none of niggas, especially you know what I'm saying. You putting the hood and shit. That's when niggas come on, bro. That's when it get it get it get tricky, bro. Straight up, I ain't going for none of it. Okay. So you, you going back and forth with him is cool, but once you start putting the hood in it and all that, and like you doing something the hood, nigga, that's when we not having. Yeah, that's a fact. Damn, so it's it, it's like that street shit, but it's a thin line when you incorporate that that entertainment shit. You feel me? I'm still trying to figure out what's what's the what's the boundaries and guidelines with that. Like I'm seeing that shit get a lot of niggas in trouble. Yeah, that shit getting out of hand, bro. Cause it ain't no motherfucking uh no boundaries no more. And the crazy shit is, it's one thing to have content, but when niggas start coming with all these extras on top of shit. It just makes shit worse, you know what I'm saying? You gotta go pull niggas like Slim. This nigga ain't no motherfucking internet nigga. You know what I'm saying? You gotta go pull all these different niggas that's that's actually <clears throat> from shit to come here and clear shit up when really it shouldn't even be nobody business. But I mean this this internet shit, bro. It, just like it shouldn't even be on there. Nigga, this hood shit ain't media covered. On the real, it shouldn't even be on this shit, period. But you know, that's like I said, man, it's a, it's a style nowadays. Them niggas try to get fame off that shit and look stupid at the same time. Game goofy. Yeah, but that's y'all regular fooling a lot. That shit regular as a motherfucker. You feel me? Like, this type of shit happen every day. Dead homies. Like, not even no specialty. It's hard to um, live and shine in LA. Yeah. Like, that's real shit. Right. Y'all, I just wanted to reset the room quickly uh, because our founders are running around in the back trying to figure out the facts so we can get to the bottom of all of this. But while you're here, please hit the greenhouse up top. You're in the UOD, Unity Overrides Our Destruction. Uh, please scroll down to the bottom of your screen, those little arrows. Share that because we want your friends in here to add to the conversation. And don't forget, in order to join the conversation, you have to hit the greenhouse up top. We'd love for y'all to join, but we keep things really around here because if you're in the UOD clubhouse, you already know that you're leaving your flags at the door because we're coming in here to get to the bottom of whatever it is. Um, we are, we're discussing crypt map. Question mark? Let's go. Hey, Ed, we can hear you. Yeah, y'all can hear me? Yeah, we hear you. Yes, sir. It's over, Damn. brother. You, you're back, back in the in matrix. matrix. Man. Yeah, you're back uh, in the matrix. Well, I'm just glad to hear that there was some, you know, it, there was a resolution. Nobody really got hurt. You know, um, there are some things we could walk away from this. Maybe it wasn't the wisest thing to put it online. However, you know what I mean? Um, some individuals express themselves and, and, and they make funds that way. So it, it can be hard to dis, disattach yourself, but you know, 
as long as niggas giving back five to community, I think that, you know what I mean, the conflicts will always figure themselves out and niggas can get back to the bag. And that's one of the things I respect over there in the uh, uh, the um, mixed motion room, mixed emotion room and in the hip hop trends room. These niggas is constantly figuring out a way to get to the bag. It's about business. This other goofy shit is cool. That's extracurricular shit. That's, that, that's side shit. Awesome. Yeah, that's, I, I, that's, that's what it's about. Bring a lot, of niggas. It's about networking and all that type of shit, nigga. Like, I, like, and when niggas don't understand, even with this nigga, right? But people don't understand, nigga, like that YouTube shit. It's it ain't like him doing. It's like more like his therapy, bro. On the day, home, you know, niggas, my nigga is schizophrenic, bro. You see me, nigga, bipolar. He so he go up and down, damn. Brother, you in the matrix, cuz? I think he getting the call. But um, I think that was one of the, the highlighting points of our last conversation was mental health and how he was actually advocating. But that's a real thing that you're talking about. And, you know, especially coming from the streets, man, you don't know how a nigga gonna respond to shit. This shit wicked out here. Yo, Eslo, let me ask you something, man. Like, when, when on a daily basis, man, what what's your synopsis on mental health in our communities man yo s loke you there oh yeah i was watching this i'm over here watching this damn c mac shit looking on what he was talking about my fucker nah you good man just um anybody from the uh the, um, the visiting guests in the room man mental health you know how is how important is that like what's the current condition of our people in your neighborhoods Shit, just speaking on me and my, me and my little section of friends, I know we all suffering from PTSD, but I know that's in all the black communities, you know, from this gang banging shit and shit like that. So, shit, it be, I feel like, that's when I feel like, that's when you, your homies got to come in and your, feel me, everybody got family members, so, feel me, you got to just stay level with some, you got to find you some real homies that you, Feel me? That's really solid in this shit. Feel me? And you gotta, you gotta be able to. I know everybody be like, I don't trust niggas. You can't trust niggas. But at the end of the day, cause you gotta go talk to somebody, cause just to be able to relieve some of that stress off you. Feel me? Cause nigga, I ain't gonna lie, nigga. I, I be out to talk to my niggas all the time, nigga. Cause some days you feel me, I ain't cool. You feel me? Some days I be wanting to spaz out, tripping all type of extra shit. So for me, you just gotta have some. You can't always, you feel me, you gotta just find some level-headed niggas and some niggas that be able to think. You can't always be around the niggas that don't want to think and just want to react to shit, you feel me? Because that, yeah. that just, that but like, that's I ain't gonna lie, nigga, like, majority of niggas, when niggas understand, nigga, majority of niggas in like, even any streets, period, nigga. You 80, baby, all that type of shit, my nigga. You stealing from crack, all type of shit, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Niggas when you understand that shit. Niggas be having a nigga, nigga, Problems reading, like, all type of shit. You know what I'm saying? But niggas don't understand it because niggas in school clowning, always nothing. But niggas really get some shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas got a lot of, it's a lot of niggas mentally ill, especially. That's what, and like, real this shit. Nigga, this nigga like, this nigga like a, a fucking, I'll be telling you, I'm saying, like, you like a bomb ready to blow, bro, on the hood. You, very, you got two different things of paranoia, you feel me, on the damn homies. To, to, you get depressed and paranoid. That shit is crazy. You know what I'm saying? That shit, like, you feel me, dude? Niggas be saying, nigga, he come up with this shit. He come with this, these slogans that don't commit suicide, all this shit, because, nigga, he know how this shit feels. Dad, homies, bro. That's why he, you think nigga, he just come up with shit and he just make up this shit out of nowhere? Hell no. This nigga feel this way. You feel what I'm saying? That's why niggas, he got, he do this shit with fives and all that. He's schizophrenic, because, so, of course, he, when he catch on the shit, he gonna keep using it. That's why he don't know how to, he don't know how to undo it. Nigga, on the dead homies. Feel me? I gotta really go yeah. with the nigga and go over and over and over and over program him to undo that shit. That shit has been years of trying to do this shit, trying to get it down pack, and he got it down pack to where the fuck it takes me. I'm trying to get that shit from him. Cause we trying to make some motherfucking money. You can't take money if you stand fives with every damn thing and they understand you. Nah, but, you're right, man. You're not you're, 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 you're speaking on that transition that's needed. Yeah, so it's like you gotta he, he getting together, and it's like when I see him, he. And I, I feel like when he help other people, it's making him help himself better. You feel me saying? Like, cause he see when he give this shit to other people, he see the, the shit they going through, the shit how they is. And he like, nigga, he was once at, like that, cause over there, you see, going through the same shit, going through uh, classes and mental problems and all that shit down there with these niggas. So that's why he couldn't do the shit he do down there, bro. You feel me? I'm good. No, and then no, we, I feel you. 
And that shit ain't on them saying on dog. I tell them every day for me, like a nigga can be greedy. Nigga be like, all right, we're getting this. We're getting 20 bands from here, 10 bands from here. Or we can just keep this to the neck. No, this nigga want to take that check. We're going to take that check and feed downtown for two weeks. I'm like, cuz, fuck it. You want to do that? Let's do it. <laughs> I'm going to take the check to the neck. But at the same shit. time, I respect it, nigga. Dad, homies, that's why I don't argue. I don't rebuttal. I don't read nothing. You feel what I'm saying? As a businessman, I'm thinking about how to make us more money. So it's like, damn, you just give money away, but at the same time, nigga, fuck it. It is what it is, because you feel me? That's our blessings, nigga, period. Can Pull I ask up, a question? Crip, crip, crip Mac crip in crip here, cuz. Yeah. Oh, Crip Mac is here. Okay, I just want to say it's real respectable that y'all taking the time to spend time with him and, and help him progress. You know what I'm saying? That's really our homie, bro. That's what I'm with y'all. What's up, What's up Crip Mac? Yeah. Uh, I said nothing. God just take all up to get issues all up. As you should. Now it's back to program time. Program time. Fire. Get back, fire the community. The Get back, fire the community. You know. Out of hood, doing doing music interviews, care on hood, and uh, just staying solid out here, care on hood. Oh, nice. Mandatory, shit. and you gotta continuously get the increments. That's a fact. Exactly. Oh yeah, fire show and save up for rainy days, care. Straight up. Yeah, man. So, how do draws? That's you, girl. No, I, yo, yo. draws up on the draws in here. No, -uh. oh, I thought that was Kel. No, I ain't draws. Oh, not Kel. Oh, uh, yo, Odium Slim, Mac. you in there? I'm in here. Odium Slim, what's up? Bro? I'm here. Oh, yeah, on, on hood. I understand what you were saying, come on, hood. I'm sure you already know. Nigga, like you, fool. Oh, baby, baby, baby stretch and big stretch was there, Kel. You fight me. I just I, on, on hood. It just you, you know how shit go, cuz when when motherfucker get the better of somebody, cuz you can't win on the DP. So that's you can't. You know, I, I told you, bro. That's why about, about man. Listen, we ain't gonna talk like that on, on the internet. But like I told you, for me, they go. It's listen, bro. You did what you had to do, bro. Period. I respect you. Well, that's I, all that matters. I, 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 you know, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep my name. Stay from the turf, cuz you fight. Exactly. exactly. It's just like the county jail and prison five motherfuckers that don't know, cuz it's just like getting out the police car and going in the enemy joint. That's, That's it. it. <laughs> I, I, I said it. I said it the right way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But we live to get money another day. That's yeah, that's that's all about. That's what I be about, bro. You feel me? Like at the end of the day, like I tell niggas, cause I tell him that I've been telling him this for months. He can, he'll tell you that a lot of niggas gonna envy you, bro. We getting dope. We gonna envy you. We gonna envy you. So once anything happen, bro, you gonna have this kind of conflict, bro. So they're homies. So keep but, uh, but, uh, you gotta look at it like this, audio slim. I, I still got my chain. I still got my thousands. Hey, <laughs> hey nobody. Uh, what yeah. about the Popeye's yeah. chicken? You got the Popeye's chicken? Yeah, we, we, we gonna we gonna do that for tomorrow, okay? Yeah. We 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 gonna order some more Caritos. Oh, hood. I heard. I just talked with Adam. I got a no jumper interview uh, coming up real soon. On her. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. On her. Oh, yeah, man, nigga, love you, fool. You already know what time it is. I, I love you. I love you fine. Kyle. Lupe, she was like, oh my gosh, bro, I get right there. You know, Lupe, Lupe she's from Phone Six, Kyle, but she don't, she really don't know about the actual, you know, the, 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 the you know, on hood. Yeah, so, I already know. I already know. She Kyle. just knows about, you know, the the neighborhood bro parties. <laughs> it's understandable. It's more than partying with this gang banging. Exactly. You know, it's phased just like the county jail, phased just like the penitentiary. It's, it's all about motherfuckers seeing what you about, cuz once you once you once you pass it, cuz it is what it is. Program you know, time. I, 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 I look, cuz I, I pass everything from DPS and everything. Cuz I'm good. I go look. So, so listen, get ready to go. Cause guess what? I'm there. I'm there. I no, no. Let's let's get this shit out the sway, cuz I'm there. Niggas ain't no customers. Hey, okay? I want to ask you, uh. You know what's your, what's your next move? You know what's your plans? You know I think. Well, uh, what, what I'm gonna you... do some uh, some more skits. You know some giveaways, uh, five the community, some gumbo, some pizza. You got an album dropping too, an uh, uh, EP dropping too. Tell them about the EP. Man. March, March, yeah, March, right? March tenth, yeah. Dropping. March tenth. Oh goddamn, cut that's the rolling thirties. <laughs> Shout out, uh, Lady uh, BK Red from Harlem. Hey, cool. Let's go on the extra. Let's do extra on the stage, bro. Hey, 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 I'm out here, gang. I'm out here, bro. Stop doing extras, bro. Stop doing extras, bro. Yeah. Yo, 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 ODM, this LV Europa, man. Yo, yeah. Yo, man. Um, I I noticed that uh, Crit Mac, he's been um advocating 
for mental health for, for a while now. And I, I'm interested in doing a project with y'all regarding some NFTs and we focus in on mental health. And I think that- Well, okay, well I mean, we, 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 we're right. good at the increments is right, but check it out. A lot of people in the county jail, like uh, uh, C-Bop will let you know on hood, like five judge motherfuckers. Oh, well, good. he mental health is that. So guess what? Yeah, I am. On they hood trip, I hit the county jail. Cuh. I have no fucking mental problems. I have nothing. I want to go where the homies or enemies at. I don't give a fuck where I land, cuz. I want all extras. I want all problems, nigga. I am H. K. Destruction. I'm Crip Mac, and I am what I'm about. Hey, Mac. You know what I'm man, listen, listen. We ain't, this this is a stage. We're not doing all that game banks right now. Hold on, we just talking, fool. Like, don't do it. We, 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 we gonna... Apologize, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, cuz. I think, um, hey, this nigga Crip Mac, you know, at this point in time, man, independent motherfucking films is like going through. We're the doing that right now. We on, we, really we on that right now, bro. That shit, bro. We already on that. Like, yeah, I'm about to yeah, say, man, that. I feel like that nigga, we write, he going to kill that today. shit. We got, we, got, we got like three writers. We're doing that shit right now. We, we're going to work, Oh, yeah, bro. hell yeah. Hell hey, yeah. get to it. Get to hell it. Yeah. That's, 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 that's what that bad call. Is right now. Hell yeah. Man, there's a lot of different ways that, that y'all can play these different avenues, man. Hey, y'all. And, and, and how you doing? No, right? ah, and we just... <laughs> that was nasty. <laughs> that was nasty. <laughs> was oh, baby, that was nasty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you five of them? <laughs> yeah, uh, chill out. Get it out. Get hey, it no, out. Nah, Better but you know what there. I think, Crip Mac. I I think what's unique about you is that uh, you have a very genuine spirit. You know what I mean. Regardless of what you go through, I think you should really focus on you know sharpening up your image as far as being on some positive shit. Like you know, I, I am. Look, look, sir. I am on some positive shit. You understand? As far as feeding the homeless and doing great things. And I also want to help a lot of people. Hello. Respect. Yes, sir. No custom oh, shit. I didn't hear you. I didn't know if you're still there. Nah, nah. So yeah, you I want I want to help a lot of people. Right. I want to feed the community. I want to do a good do, do good things. As far as look, and you listen this, this morning, Kev. You find me. I let people know. You know, kids go to school on hood Monday through Friday. Look, y'all not gonna see perfect. Y'all not gonna get perfect grades. A C is something nifty. You can get a C. You know, it's acceptable. But always try your hardest. I understand parents aren't the best parents. Just do good in school and you will make it out here. Yeah? I let people know, you know, good shit where I think uh, on hood, I got a fan base. Cause they going to listen on hood. And, I, and that's basically what I want. Like basically encourage it because people gravitate towards you because of the positivity you spread. Yes, you know yes, I have a lot of positivity in me. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. And I, and that's what we commend you on, because uh, when we first did a room, this stats to eighty, by the way, you know, we were speaking on you know things that she was doing, and we wanted to make sure you was okay. So I know if you continue oh, yes, to do yes, positive sir, positive things, sir, more people will sir, sir, I appreciate you, sir. I am HK. Thank you. I just told you that, Mac. Why you doing, bro? Well, I'm letting him know. Yeah, you're all right. Just say you're all right. You know you're all right. Just say I'm all right. I'm nifty. I'm exactly nifty. that part. We can we can do we'll the nifty. That, we can do the nifty. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The nifty How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Right. With nifty. How y'all doing? Thank you for having me on stage. Uh, Crip Mac, can I ask you a question, sir? Are you a man or a woman, Kel? <laughs> oh my God! Hey, stop I'm being respectful. What are you? Be respectful, like that, Mac. I could go on you, especially after your right. review today. But well, hold on, Mr. Wayne. Nah, I, 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 I kicked him. He was doing too much. I kicked him. He gone. Yeah, nah, girl, I'm not, not doing Mac, all Mac, that. Mac, 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 Mac. Come on, girl. But Wack, look, 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 listen though. You gotta, you gotta, gotta respect people though, cause real shit, bro. Like, like back to the like you saying with the uh, with the with the giveaways and shit, bro. That's what we try to do, bro. Like, like, we got a lot of we got a lot of bad shit about us. You feel me? All that shit, bro. And from what he 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 super crip. He about super cripping about cripping cripping. So we going back to what cripping really started at, nigga. So we going that's what it means. We fuck with the community. That's what we started at. So if cripping started there, that's what we gonna start at. You feel me? That's what you know. what I'm saying. 
That's how we do it. Yeah, that's still living. That's where you want to get the real love. You know what? I, 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 can y'all hear me? Yeah, we hear you. Yeah, I think I think that uh when you said that last night, Slim, uh I think that maybe you do, but maybe Crip Mac don't understand the importance of you even saying those words. Because he don't listen, bro. He when you he gonna catch it. He do, that's my nigga, bro. We we like like I said, bro. This is my nigga. We 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 do like we do deep thoughts. We do deep shit like. And right now, I'm good. he on the internet, he chilling, he probably drinking a little bit, he gonna bam. We catch him in the morning, right. we chop it up and talking, right. nigga. Everything clicking, real, real shit. Right. Bebop, Bebop is big homie. <laughs> so, I listen. But, right. yeah. Yeah. but, but I, think, I just think that with, with the power, with the target market that he got within inner city communities worldwide, just as he's bringing about that change for mental health, just as he giving back fire to community, I believe that also um, being able to continue to push positive neg That's narratives the in the community, uh, be a be a leading position for these young young niggas that they can follow and look up to. Like, damn, I I could still be from the set, or I could still be cool in the community and give back to the community. That don't mean that I have to be no uh, 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 on suicide watch. That don't mean a nigga got to be a custer or no bullshit like that. But you yeah. can still walk back then. Sir, look, you sir, 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 you're right, right about that. You understand? Uh, give back people, should, you know, uh, other gangbangers should give back five to the community and do great things. But what motherfuckers fail if I realize, cuz, you still got to come around what hood you from. If you stop coming around, uh, you, it, it pretty much, cuz, it's like, all right, let's say we send you this year, cuz, you went five jail this year, cuz, you ain't get out another. I don't hear you, Snello. Mac. You got a phone call. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. He I'm here to be shot, fat ass. A lot of homies want to <laughs> fuck your wife and her cooking ass. But they respect, they respect hey, listen, you. Oh, no. They respect you, and they want you to come to the hood because they ain't seen you in a while. But they're happy five you on hood. What's that going through, Mac? What are we talking about? That was the topic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he finished off with it. No, listen, I know, listen, let's go that. Listen, I know, I listen, I listen to my nigga, so I know he like, he like, uh, uh, he was saying last time, like, uh, I was telling him, like, me, we get out the hood and all that shit, bro. He was telling me myself, like, bro, look, I can't really leave like that. You feel me? He feel like, nigga, when a nigga in the hood, when you in the hood and you a nigga in your hood and shit like that, that's when you got more power to do shit like that. You feel me? When you just a nigga that just. Well, see, Bob, see, Bob, you're, you're the general. <laughs> The world. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. he said this. Is what he told me the other day. Right? I was like, nigga, hey, that, that, go ahead and leave. Fifty Seventh Street. Nah. <laughs> but like, like, he said we supposed to leave, right? Well, I told him to leave. He like, nah, because if we stay right here, the niggas we is in these streets, we got more power. We got more, more power to play with. You feel me? Then, then to leave and and he looked at like we not really a nigga over in the set. That's what he was like. You know, so I don't know. That's what he getting at this moment. But that's what he was getting at that night. I get it. Hey, can y'all pull up Lady Michelle? Yes, sir. Yeah, that's that's. I, we get it. I understand. <clears throat> yeah, but you gotta let people know. You know, when you're a gang banger, there's issues. Care don't run from your issues. Get your issues out the sweat. Uh, guess what? At the end of the day, cuz people gonna respect you, cuz no matter how how bruising you are, cuz it's about representing where you're from. Just like I said. In the county jail, it's like, you, know, you look hold on, hold on, hold on, girl. You get out the, you get out the fucking police car, cuz Guess what? And they, they, you have your, you know, cards and shit. You have maybe at Wayside or CJ on the hood. They take you where you go, cuz You might land in the enemy's dorm in the middle of the night. Right? <laughs> on neighborhood crib, you gonna have to fight hard. On neighborhood crypt, so it's just part of life, cuz. And if people ain't ready to fight this type of shit, cuz, just give it up. That's it's life ain't for Custis. Yeah. It's just hey, beatings after cool. beatings. Yeah, this life ain't for everybody. It's not fucking period. It's not fucking period. But that's I, not do, I do understand my reputation is everything. I'm from 55th Street. So, you know. Yeah, somebody, pull somebody pull Lupe up. Did somebody pull Lupe? I did it. Uh, uh, Lupe, she's driving. Uh, Lu Lu Lupe, she in here. Lupe, 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 Lupe,
What's up, you man? Neighbor, 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 neighbor. Hey, niggas don't understand, cuz when niggas got an issue, bro, do you know how long it takes for niggas to come take the issue? Yeah, exactly, nigga, months, nigga, on the day. Niggas be like, I'm in Palmdale, nigga. I'm yeah. Like, I'm, I, bro, I can't come right now. I'm, nigga, C Mac pulled up and got his issue out the way, cuz, and that's a man, bro. Well, well you you know, cuz, uh, I take 55th Street at heart, cuz, that's it. You know what I mean? That's what I, I love, take bro. At heart, cuz, that's it, cuz. So you fight me, and I don't stay much far from the hood, so it's no excuse. Lupe, here's the gas money. Get your chunky <laughs> Mexican ass over there on 55th. Hey, hey, and hey, let's get this shit out of the Hey, listen. Hey, be nice, Chris. Hey, be hey, nice. See, man. Chill, cuz. Chill. We, we, we love, we love Lupe. Don't disrespect Lupe, nigga. Low. Yo, see, man. You know, Chill out, cuz. Relax. Do not disrespect Lupe, nigga. I didn't disrespect him. Oh, man, Mac. Relax. The homie didn't disrespect me. I, you know, my, my the homie had to do what he had to do, and I took him. You know. Yeah, Lupe, and guess what? <laughs> he kept it Forty Sixth Street. I took care of my issue now. Leon neighborhood crib. And... I'm a hey, 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 Lupe, how did you feel when you got that call? What was going through your mind? I mean, cause how I look at it, cause it's my life, nigga. If, 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 you know, and if you run from a DP cut, you all bad in the hood, nigga. You, it's it's, 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 it's all custer shit. <laughs> you got some motherfuckers that don't come get DPs within years, thinking homies gonna fight again. No, nigga, we still waiting on you, niggas. Cut. Not everybody's in jail. <laughs> There's other homies that told other homies, and they still waiting on that same motherfucker. Hey, cut. You gonna wait? You gonna wait? And beat your ass in that alley. It's part of gangbanging. Hey, we still waiting for a gang nigga still, too, though. I love gangbanging. I'm still waiting on a nigga from last hey, week. I swear to God, me, too, nigga. We still waiting on that same nigga. I'm still <laughs> waiting on the <laughs> same nigga. I'm still <laughs> waiting on the same nigga, bro, from last hey, week. Hey, Napo, what's going on with you, nuts <laughs> out? Yo, Napo, that nigga ducking? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that nigga been ducking. Mm -hmm. Ducking. <laughs> but he ducking hey, the whole hey, squad. Was, it, yeah, that's crazy, man. That's so when he hey, pull up, they know. probably going to beat him. We get a reset. get a reset. Yeah, we got you. Everybody, welcome to the UOD. Unity overrides our destructions. We leave our flags at the door, and we come talk as grown men and women. We have special best guests in the building. Crit Mac. OG. <laughs> oh, yeah, yup, yup. Glasses alone, neighbor. <sighs> Y'all know the family over there, man. Mix the motions. Hip-hop trends. Team 400. Polo gang. Oh, the... the Oh, Cadillac! Oh my goodness, the stage is flooded. Uh, and don't don't forget my brother Ice Beasy, man. Why Ice Beasy? Ice Beasy. We don't want to miss nobody. Everybody <laughs> know what to do, man. You scroll up to the top, you hit that greenhouse, you follow the moderators, and you definitely follow our guests. You are now introduced to program times five. Crip Mac, the floor is yours. Shout out to all the clubs in the building. Salute, salute. Salute, 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 Oh yes. Damn, somebody sound like they're in a UFO. Yeah. Yeah. I think that was that. Yeah, 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 that was he coming back. <laughs> Can I say something? Yes, sir. yes, sir. I just want to shout out Crip Mac for the uh, education thing. Because I'm, I'm currently attending college right now, man. It's been days while I've been thinking about dropping out that shit. But I just want him, I just want him to know what he said earlier in the... Uh, in the convo, I just want to shout them out for the education and shit, and you know, and helping people keep striving because 
a lot of people don't know that education shit mean a lot. Yeah, I mean, it mean a lot in my family because I'm the only one going to college right now and shit like that. So it just mean a lot, you know, getting support from that shit, man. So I want to salute Crip Mac on that and everybody in this room, too. Yeah, yeah, keep going, brother. Don't yeah, never give up. Yeah, you hear me? Don't yeah. don't never give up. Never commit suicide, and don't be five a custer. Most definitely. Exactly. Most definitely. <laughs> I say, Aaron. Look, man, I got a question. I wish for I could turn back if he's still there. Real quick, real quick, real quick. It's a couple educated crips on here, bro. Plenty. That got our it's educated on. people. Period. That oh, you had something to say? Yeah, oh, fat. To the bro, shout out, man. shout out to everybody in this room, though, for real. Shout out to one, yes, sir. No, one, mic, one, mic, you, one mic on Polo. I wanted to tell the brother, man, I salute you for that and keep doing what you're doing, man. You you making people like me happy with that couldn't that didn't make it. I'm 39 years old, my my guy, and I dropped out of school at an early age because of the streets, cho choosing the street life. And now you, I want to see you. You got a better chance. You can do the things that I can't do. So I, I want you to keep doing what you're doing, man. You got people like me. You don't even know that's going to support you, brother. So, so I'm, I'm sitting down for sure for you too. I, I think Alex had a question. You had a question, Alex. I did, I did have a question, and it for Crip Mac or Lupe, but um, I come from the culinary industry, and I really need to know what a chorito is. A Cerrito. A Cerrito. A Cerrito's a, 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 a burrito. It's a burrito with a C. It's Cerrito. I'm sorry. A Cerrito. A burrito. Yes, yeah, it's, 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 it's a burrito with a C. Cerrito. Oh, really? Cerrito. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sorry. That's all yeah, it is. Yeah, it's just being deceived with shit. Yeah, it's just being deceived with shit. Just that. If you ever look, I think about the word. I got a five on it. If you got a five on it, just think about a number. If you got a if you got a C on it, if, I mean, if you got it, it sounds crazy. And you got a C, just think about bees and, and, and different shit. It sounds and bees so shit. delicious, though. Yeah, it is, probably. It's delicious as hell. <laughs> hey, hey, his, his audio nah, we call... fucked up the whole thing, right? And But one thing we heard was, let me get to 10 tacos and get Lupe five Caritos. <laughs> <laughs> we got to hey, get that on the menu. To we got to get Caritos on the menu. <laughs> Nigga need to trademark hey, that. Yeah, don't forget he say five fries. Not French fries, five fries. <laughs> right. No, hey, we don't uh, say No, we don't say we don't say what's the F at all. We say five fives. Right. We don't say the French fries. Yeah. We just say right. five. We don't say no other one. Hey, no, can I, I give a shout out to the hood? Send that nigga to the goo. Melly Mel. Who said that? Pulling up. Cause that's where you going. Liddy Michelle. You done fucked up. <laughs> shout out, shout out hold on, hold on, man. One mic on Deuce, man. Let Deuce finish. Let Deuce land. No, I, I couldn't hear the po hood post, man. He's a YouTuber, but he also one of the G homies up out of Compton Crip. I did fan time with, man. Shout out to the Melly Mel, man. Okay. And I appreciate that. Hey, what's up, uh, that love We got Liddy Michelle in here, though. Liddy, what's up? Liddy, what it do? What's the deal, y'all? What's the deal? I'm I'm, I got I'm doing like six things at once, but I seen you was on here, so I tapped in. I wanted to oh, hear what Crip Mac was talking about too. Yeah, oh, it's you Liddy, tapped in on Crip Mac, dude. Yeah, that's, <laughs> how, I'm saying, that's all. I'm just saying that's all you seen on here. You only saw yeah. him. That's her song <laughs> at the top. Hey, wait, who who shot Liddy? Who wait, did that? Who, who did that? They probably tried to make her a moderator. It wasn't me. We got my nigga G Malone in here, man. It wasn't me. We got Ice yeah. Beezy. We got G Malone. Oh, Y'all got me fucked up. Who did? We got a lot of white slub. It was, it was an accident. Our bad. Y'all cold. I'm like, dang, I ain't even oh, we, we, we not. <laughs> we, we wouldn't do you like that. We not five a custer. Nah, nigga, that, that's what you always gangbanging on You're me. Nick Bone every time you hear I me seen Nick Bone in invite. Like, what up? You know. Always gang banging on the nigga. But we got your link up top showing you love, Liddy. If y'all ain't heard it, it's uh Liddy Michelle, corrupt, Ash Bass the rapper, and Leah Wright. She can freak it. Check that shit out. Shit fire. Yes, yeah, sir. give her a view. Don't be five a and custom. Give her a comment and let her know you OD sent you. Yes, Fact. sir. It's for fact. You five me. I I'm just concerned, left, like man, how come I never, I, I never, you never, uh, you never introduced me. That's how rude of individuals. Yeah, he's gone, bro. Like, <laughs> he, yeah, he gone. He, he, yeah. yeah. 
They got shit going on. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for putting my link out there too. I'm like working right now too. Nah, you saying tiny draws? I'll bring them up. Hold on. Hey, lady, don't trip you in debt, my nigga. Okay. I, got I just brought up Tiny Draw. Who in debt? Liddy uh, Michelle. Liddy. Uh, yeah, but she still ain't introduced us, though. Hey, can we get the UOD link, man? Child. Right after you introduce them. <laughs> yeah, like, you see how this shit, this is like weird like as hell. Awesome. Like, how you just bring somebody in, don't introduce hey. Hey, 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 Stacks 280, I want you to meet Liddy Michelle, the gorgeous South Central legend, you know? <laughs> She's a young legend, you know? Liddy you Michelle, said put our link my, up? That's that my co-host, co that's Stacks 280. He cripping up out of Jersey, you know what I'm saying? Obviously, he got an eye on you, so. Nah, you ain't got to put the extras you know in there. I'm just, I just wanted to be formally. No, nah, I just know you're a dirtbag, nah, man. I ain't no dirtbag. <laughs> yeah. Don't put, don't put that on me. You, you never know what the future may hold. Don't put that on me. Like no. That. Don't put that on us like that. <laughs> 45. <laughs> Yo, hey. <laughs> LV, can we get some? Oh, I, I play some. Come on, man. You know I keep something. Yeah, you know we need that, man. We I got need it. that. We need that fix. Got you. Shout man. out to Off the Mud. What if I told y'all in the U O D? I appreciate it. Let's keep it a stack. Fuck what you believe, nigga. L V Rope. Uh, what the yo? Long live for the loved ones. Better never change if the guns come. I've been from the bottom of the block, no prop, little nigga. I'll run something. Uh, I'm still from the New York streets, it's cold, little nigga. Can't be. I'm from the hood with that paperwork party on clubhouse, still nigga read it and we. Some shit change. This is for real. Uh, better stay in your lane. How you gonna talk about a life that you ain't even live? Oh, D, all you did is complain. You ain't never stacked that bread. You ain't get tapped in the head. You ain't get jacked by the feds. You ain't never trapped all night for the kids. I can't even relax on my bed. Long live or the hate it. Look, nigga, I made it. I'm never worried about niggas turn agent dog. I've been on my way on the matrix. Y'all niggas basic. That's juice Eminem. Maybe hit that lady. Or I parlay in the realest of rooms with the coons. And I knew that you niggas was crazy. So I hit uh, two kitty, or maybe I stretch it two times. I let that know what can't work. Yo, got it, nobody was lit like mine. Now every day I'm just making a way to pay for all of this hit with crimes. And I'm just hitting the club with all of the thugs. You best to be getting in line. And just like that. Hey, 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 what if we told you unity override destruction yo, can Lamonte, change yo, everything? That's a fact. What's up, Ryan? Hey. hey, what up? What up? What's up? What's up? Hey, I'm just getting on here though. What happened with uh feel me and what happened with Crip Mac though? What happened though? I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Well, Crip Mac and his homies had some issues. Niggas took their DPs, niggas took their phase, and that's where it's at. Nigga, niggas, niggas back to program time. Niggas trying to go. <laughs> hey, fat profit. Hey, fat profit. What's that hey, on your CTR, hey, bro? You said niggas back to program time. What it look like. <laughs> Yeah, why you, why you, I thought I thought I thought that I thought that was a little like like your relatives and shit like. No, that. I'm saying what? No, I'm saying I'm, I ain't, I don't know what's going on. I'm trying to figure out like what what happened though. Like, oh, I, you I ain't, you ain't you never like, heard what, the what's talk? Going on? Nah, I I'm just that. promoting the homie Raz. <laughs> oh, okay. so the nigga, the nigga, the nigga, the nigga was floss flagging the Monty or something. That's what's going on. Nah, he got his homies in here if they want to speak on it. Oh no, nah, yeah. I was just trying to figure out what was going on. I just, I just. Oh, oh you don't want to talk to his homies about it, huh? <laughs> nah, don't be fine with Custer. Yeah, don't, don't be a Custer. Hey, 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 hey Lamonte, ain't nothing like that. I was just. Oh, uh, uh, Custer. Hey, hey, I was trying to figure out what was going on. Don't be. A, you gonna be a Custer that in front is, of all these people? That is kind of crazy. Like, why you don't just ask the horse mouth? Like, yeah, straight from the horse mouth. Uh, nah, because I see, I see, I see about three rooms talking about Crip Mac. Goddamn. Yeah, but his, his homies in this room, though. Yeah, his homies in this room. Yeah, but his homies in this room, though. Right. Crip Mac was in here. 
Yeah. Oh, oh it's right. gonna be yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, what happened though? I'm trying to figure out what happened. Yeah, what's going on? What happened with the Crip Mac though? Nah, they, they, it was all love. That's all. It was all love. You know. So Crip Mac ain't look no more. Crip, Crip Mac ain't nah, look no more. It's nah, all he's love. Still it's all love. Whoa, whoa. Who said? Wait a second. Who said he stopped five the community? Who said that? He for sure Loki. Jay, uh, Jay Watts. Yeah, yeah. I was just trying to figure out. I was just asking, bro. Ain't nothing like that. I was trying to figure out what he had going on. That's all. Bro. Yeah, you just got what, what. What we were telling you was his homies is in here. So when you shoot things like he ain't crip no more, somebody in the crowd could take that the wrong way. We don't want to leave the audience running with that. So and that wasn't trying to play you or no disrespect. But oh yeah, yeah, that's fair. That's yeah, fair. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I feel you. I, feel you. I, I was just, yeah, I was just asking. I ain't no. I, I got. No well, I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm about to. Uh, hey, Jay, you see that? Hey Jay, you well, see that? Hey, let, let, me, let, me, no. let me explain it real quick, Fats, real quick. Right? Hold on, that's why I hit Lamont up. Like, that's why that's why I hit Lamont up, because I already know like this UOD, you don't know, shout out to y'all room and shit. But I know Lamont, like me and Lamont be chopping up in the back channel sometimes and all that shit. So that's why I said I asked Lamont what was going on. Mm -hmm. I was trying to figure out like I see three rooms talking about Crip Mac got jumped, got beat up, and I see y'all room say he DP, we still program. So I was just trying to figure out what was going on. I don't mean to disrespect nobody, though. I was just trying to figure out what was going yeah. on. Yeah, well, well let, let, let me just tell you what. First and foremost, I love my team, UOD. It's a sensitive issue when you talk about all the gang wars in L.A. between Bloods and Crip. So when this shit all go down, instead of who they would say, a Brim or a Blood, who would be so-called worst enemies with them, the out the mud dudes felt comfortable coming here because they know niggas wasn't going to spin no false narrative. Yeah, that's, right? that's a fact. That's real fact. recognized real. That's right. real that's so, yeah, so, you know, with that, that's why everybody was kind of like making sure, like, bro, don't try to get me to speak up on it when his homie's in here, nigga. Nobody can speak better for him than him and his homie. Oh, okay, yeah, facts, facts. I feel you. I feel you on that, though. Yeah, that's what. That's what yeah, facts. I ain't gonna lie. This nigga, right? I ain't gonna lie. This nigga hit me immediately. As soon as he heard the shit narrative, bro, he hit me. My personal line, you know what I'm saying, bro. Got my personal line, whatever. Cut hit me. Boom. M hit me. What's going on? Woo, woo. I tell him, was, yeah, this was happening. You know what I'm saying? I just spent. I really wasn't gonna spend nobody's shit. You feel me? But I spent to the first shit. This is gonna send break shit down. But I was coming here for show, sure, like you feel me? I know you are. You are. Um, you are D. I got me having the real shit going on, bro. Niggas is big bullshit. Most niggas be bullshit. Like, what he had got DP for? Claiming another set? He, no, he really, it's, bro, it's really, it, 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 he got DP because when he got, he, the issue really was all the stuff think, going on. Hey, Cud, you think that's like business we should speak on? I think that's private. Yeah, I think I, that's, I first. Think that's five, five, hey, five. Hey, yeah, What's going that's, on? I what think, think that's y'all business. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Like gang on. conversation only. Yeah, exactly. real talk. That's that. That's that's y'all business. That yeah, I mean, we, we don't need to know that. We love that nigga for what we love him for what he do. Hey, 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 yeah, well, he he green. He, he he in the hood. You feel me? Straight up. He in the next straight. room talking about it, and he don't have no problem with seeing every thought of extra shit. So I just wanted to know right. from other, you know, what. Really oh, then what you go ahead and talk? Just ask him then. Well, I nah, I ain't got exactly. no. Problem. That's all that matters then. We ain't talking to. I don't even talk to the nigga blood. Real right talk. Then. It is what it is then. Who's that nigga with all the extra? Who is that with all the extras? Fat Profit. What's up with, we, we just spoke on that. What's up with all the extras? Why is it extra? Nah, because you basically, they asking like you can go ask him. Now you ain't really worried about it. And then you just going to blood the nigga. Like, bro, we going to leave our flags at the door. We not doing that up in here. And if See, you can't I respect that it. respectfully, you could go, bro. Boy, I've been I hitting, I've been the hitting with the chocolate too. Respectfully, yeah. I said the other no, five. No, no, like, no, we got, we yeah, got, no, no, bro, we got that, that was, bro. I'm, I'm a nigga, bro. I'm, I'm really from the streets, nigga. My family, niggas, Blackstones and all type of shit, brims and all that, bro. So I just, right. nigga, I don't, that's, that's, that don't hurt my heart at that's all. That's why I said, no, you know, I get that. I said I, it like, I get a, that, right? like a good way. That's but how you say it. I feel you, bro. I feel you said the five. I feel you, bro. But nigga don't, you keep saying blood to me, bro. That shit don't hurt my heart. You feel me on the day? I be around bloods all the time. We live this life. What? Real shit. Hey, well, that's not the point. The I, point feel you, I feel what you're saying, bro. I understand what you're saying, bro. I feel what you're saying. 
you know, if, if me and you just kind of, I'm like, yeah, my nigga on blast, this and that. That's one thing. When a nigga talking and it's a back and forth and nigga like some some blood, like, come on with all the extras. Yeah. My nigga, it wasn't even like that. Yeah, nigga ain't even worry about no shit like that, bro. Nigga, I just I like to learn this the internet, right. bro. You feel me? Nigga gonna do what they want to do. Yes, were you able to leave a voicemail? Yeah, real talk. Look, Lupe on her business. Yeah, I wasn't saying it with that copy of ten, homie. So, for sure. All right, all right. Salute then. Salute. You know, half of my family, half girl, of my family, come on the park, nigga. So you know, I'm not biased at all. For sure, for sure. Yeah. What up? What up, hot what you got girl? Going on? Shit, sitting here smoking my blunt, listening to y'all. You got your coffee. All oh no, you know it's daytime now, oh, right. so I'm drinking. I'm drinking me a little soda before I get ready to drink me a little douce. Okay. You love that gasoline, don't you? That shit's terrible. <laughs> Damn, nigga sent me to the goop. I like Hold I out. like douce because I like Hennessy, but douce is like kind of more smoother. It's a different after effect, so I like that too. But my shit is Hennessy. That shit too strong, hot girl. I can't fuck with you. Mm. No, nah, get that Hennessy, that Remy, or that douce. Remy definitely, especially seventeen thirty eight. That babe. shit tastes like cat litter. Seventeen thirty, huh? Yeah, you, you know what cat litter tastes like in a liquid form, though. How you know that? Bro, that shit rough, bro. Yo, Lamonte, case it is rough. I'm a weed smoker. That's it. I'm sm look. I just lit the blunt right now. That's yeah, I can fuck with you on that. I'm about to, I'm about to light up with you. I'm about to light up with you. And pain only. You know, oh. Spoken while I um while I was listening. I hear all the. All the, all the good shit, all the bad shit, I've been hearing all the no, shit. Alcohol just don't taste good to me. It might be just me. Why you don't like alcohol? No, I mean, I do, but like yeah. the strong shit, that shit don't taste good to me. I need something to taste good. Baby. Yeah, I drink I, I drink thigh juice. Poor baby. You a grown ass man talking about you what drink thigh juice. Thigh juice? The, the thigh juice, yeah, thigh thigh juice is like uh the little Mike's Hard thigh Lemonades thigh and shit. Juice. I fuck with them. Thought juice, that's the shit. That's yeah, wine cooler. He can't even. He can't even go to a bar and order that. Well, you a lie. I went. I, I went to the club and ordered screwdrivers, nigga. Fuck you talking about. You yeah, yeah, yeah. Proudly. Yeah. He over there ordering yeah. fruity yeah. drinks yeah. with a straw. Yeah. With a straw. Yeah. Proudly. <laughs> no, I don't care about that. Yo, yo, what's that? Yo, yo. Hey, hey, fat. Yeah. Did the thought juice cost forty dollars? Hey, no, 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 no. <laughs> you put in the goo, bring it back up. Just who, 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 Lupe? Newport, Newport. Oh, Newport, okay. You better go back. Newport. Newport. My fault, y'all. Y'all make sure y'all following the house sometimes. We, we got a couple shooters on stage. If they don't see you following, they really be on their job. So we apologize for that. But just make sure, bare minimum, we following the house. Oh. If, if there's any voices that you like. Lives. Follow the moderators as well. Hey yo, hey yo, hey yo. I just, hey yo. I just want to shout out the room, man. Some real ass niggas on this, uh, in this, in this group. U O D on um, Lamonte, L V, all the mods, really. But uh, stats to it, all y'all boys. I just want to shout y'all boys out, man. Y'all boys be speaking that real shit every day, and I, you know, what I'm saying I appreciate that. Y'all some boys, some real niggas though. Salute. And if y'all need to the room, you, and y'all don't know how. If y'all don't know how to follow the house, just scroll all the way to the top. If you scroll all the way to the top. You gonna see U period O period D. That's it, and you are gonna see a Monopoly house, right? The little Monopoly board game houses is green. Just click on that little green Monopoly house, and you are gonna see it's gonna say join. So you join it, and you end the game. And just know, once you click join, you are officially anti-custom. Hey, and make sure y'all go pick up that new single game over by Razz Cash. Yeah, I just uh want to say what's up. Make sure y'all pick up that new single called Game Over by Hot Girl. Right here, right here. Hello. Uh, I just want to say what's up to the room. I'm single from Lady Homie. I do what I want on all platforms. Hello. Yo, what's up? Hey, yo, Monte. Okay, what's okay. We got the female rappers in here. Okay. Hey, 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 hey Looney got something to say. Looney got something to say. Yo, what's up, everybody? Hey. I just want to say this is one of the best clubhouse clubs on this app. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. I fuck with y'all. You and uh, appreciate you that. Appreciate you that. Hey, thank you. Hey, LV. What's the word? We we got a uh, where's one eighteen Kev man? Is he in here? Nah, he probably stepped away for a second. 
Hey, I'm going to say Popeye something. Popeye in the building. Salute Popeye. Popeye. LB. Yo, what's Chilling up? Like we got to tell what happened dog. when we was in that room last night where uh, Eminem was Popeye getting clowned. And that shit was funny, guys. Me, LV, and 18, one of 18 Kev was in this room. Hassan Campbell and Eminem was in there. And they was cracking jokes about Eminem. One dude said that he has a harmonica in his throat. That's why he talked the way he do. That shit was fucking hilarious. I, I thought he was trying to copy Crip Mac, to be honest. That yeah. shit was hilarious. That's, he is, that's, that ain't his real voice. That nigga just trying to I know jack Crip Mac. The person ain't going to copy the same cadences, like. Your voice is your fingerprint. You feel me? I find they, they, they caught him talking regular in the room. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, he sound like, like a fucking room. hot water heater. Hey man, I'm a, I'm a literally take. I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get me some puppets, some a bunch of Muppets. You remember the Muppet Show back in the day? And I'm just gonna put voices. I'm gonna put the clubhouse voices on them. Nah, nah. Keep it Fifty Fifth Street though. Hey, I'm on YouTube right now. Eban Films. Hey, bring uh, up my bring up my cut. Uh, bring up my zone, brother Skrilla, man. Skrilla. Much Skrilla. love the Crip, man. I just brought up Skrilla. Much love the Crip, man. Back he gets please. back by the community. Yo, what's up? what's up, up with you, bro? What's up, cuz? What's good with you, man? About time I got you on here, man. We got ice. Y'all sound man. gay as fuck. Hey, who what's said up, that? Man? Yeah, who I said got, that, bro? I got a flip flop with Don't your worry, name on it. Hey right, man, we ain't gonna tolerate no disrespect in he, he, here, bro. He Cause I spit in your face. Yeah. Where that? Who, who, was, who, yeah, who was that? Who was that? I spit in his face. It doesn't matter. It was GCS. Man, y'all. Hey, moderators ain't playing up in here. You come disrespect. We we. Yeah. Out of here, yeah. smoking shit. It, it's oh. easy to we, hey, 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 ice beasy. We you, we unified, <laughs> but we'll destroy your motherfucking ass. You come playing. Together. Girl, watch the deal, fool. Watch what. Yeah. Wow. He finna be in everybody back channel now. Okay. Yeah, hey, look, I want to introduce y'all. That's my brother from the hood. You know what I mean? That's my zone brother. You know what I'm saying. You know the shit we treated like we the same mom, same pops type shit. You feel me? You already know, cuz all. You already, man. Like we be out here, man. Shout out to man. Follow respect, him, man. Respect. follow him too. Thanks, man. That's what's Trying up. To off. Popeye, what you vibing on, Triple OG? Oh, I'm just, you know me. I'm just chilling. You, I know, you know, I can't do too much of nothing right now. Just hanging out. Yo, what's going on, Popeye? What it do? What it do? How you everybody feeling? Chilling. I ain't heard from Mess. What's heard going on, Mess? Yeah, I was yeah. going to say, what's up to Mess? Oh, He's brave, mess up mess right here. I'm bring here. Up the homie what's Blue going strip. on, what Mess? Up, bring up How you doing, mess? brother? That's the neighborhood Shit, right you know Bring up who? Blue Strip? Blue strip. Yeah. Blue strip. All right, yeah. I just sent the man. What's right? up with you, family? Yo, yo, yo I want to ask Popeye a question. Yo, Popeye, are you available? Y'all niggas most definitely, shot, most definitely. Y'all done shot My blue brother. strip, pull him up. Pull him up and, and give him his yeah, name. Yeah, up with you? Hey, I, like wait one second, right. I want to ask Popeye a question real quick. Hey, Popeye, man. Um, how common is the DP in, in, in your current situation? Say that again. How common is the DP in your current situation? Well, it's not as common as it used to be. It didn't... Uh, it didn't fade it down because cats don't get caught up in that in that bullshit, you know. So, so uh, it's not as common as it used to be. It used to be very common, but you know, not as much. But it's okay. just a, it's okay. just another. Really, it's just another day in the park. That's just a way of life, you know. Get cat get caught up in in some uh, perpetrating, yeah. and you know, it is what it is. Have, 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 wait one second. Wait one second. Popeye, you know, no disrespect with this question. Have you ever had to be DP? No, never. You know what? Because you, what it is, is, is if you raise correctly by the right people and they give you what you need to survive, then you ain't got to worry about getting DP. If you, if you, you know, you stay in your lane, then you don't have to worry about getting DP. You know, uh, and I don't, I can't even say that I came close. You know, because uh, one thing I always do is I stay in my lane and I pay attention 
to everything and everybody. And uh, when I was younger, I knew I was in a position to take orders. So I must take orders. So, you know, that's that life, living that life. Understood. Well, real quick, well, so I, uh, go ahead, I, Messi. Uh, oh, okay. And, and plus, I, you know, Popeye is up there in age like me. And uh, Popeye, res- Popeye respect a G homie. You know what I'm saying? So if there's somebody older than him that's, you know what I'm saying, trying to lace him with some game, he going to listen to that game. He going to take that, accept that, and then he going to apply it. And then he's going to pass that game on down to the next little homie coming in up under him. Understood. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to speak on DP, right? Uh, I was one of the ones that was always going to enforce the DP. But I understood the power of the unity, that no man could be bigger than the whole. You know what I'm saying? And if and I'm going to make sure that I'm right, because today I could say the wrong thing or reveal too much, and somebody going to hold me accountable. You understand what I'm saying? That's why I be real close. Like, well, nah, listen, we ain't going to talk about that on here, because it's a code of ethics that a motherfucker abide by so that you within the laws of the and the realms of the politics. You know, you step up out of that. Ain't nobody bigger than, you know what I'm saying? And you need that discipline to hold people accountable. That's kind of like why we got too much snitching now. Because people ain't holding rats accountable. If it was like, what's that shit called? The purge? And motherfuckers, everybody was like, yeah, I heard he got caught up snitching. Oh, yeah, he was hot. Yeah, they got the paperwork on him. He died on paperwork. And niggas get to hearing that more and more often. Maybe they'll start thinking twice, like, man, these niggas really ain't playing about this snitching shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, look at what you call them, though. Um, William O'Neill, Wild Bill, that told on Fred Hampton, right? And this is deeper than the gang shit, right? When when Wild Bill ended up killing himself, when he realized the deaths of what he had did, you know what I'm saying? Like, he was Judas. You know, and, and and we go get into ethics and we get an integrity and principles and morals and the character of a man. Like, before we gangbang it, before we any of that shit, we men. You know what I'm saying? And it came so much into question after he gave up Fred Hampton. For that little bitty chump chain, he ended up killing himself. So... For those who advocate telling and think that working with the police in the community is the best option, I, I disagree. I think that we got to take our communities back. Earlier, ODM Slim said some powerful shit. Facts. I think y'all y'all sleeping on exactly what his presence means. The way that they are changing the narrative on a lot of shit within our community. It's always going to come to them young niggas. The ones that's hot, the ones that set the trends in the Bronx or in South Central, Watson, Compton, Long Beach, H-Town, Atlanta. In those communities, the, the, the slang, the clothing, what's hot, what's not, the, uh, uh, the haircut, the, the designs in the hair, everything, all of these trends, what music is hot starts in our community. They do, but also, I was when I when I came home last time, you know, I've been in Atlanta for a minute, but when I came home last time, I went to my, my grandma's house on 120th Street in Willowbrook. And um I drove I drove around the block, the neighborhood and everything, and you know, man, I, I realized like after seeing all the bars, the way the houses look, bars on all the doors, all the windows, it just now that reflecting, it just feel like we grew up in jail, bro. And we don't even really realize the conditioning of the neighborhoods to even make us feel like it's is it, it, that simple. Yo, wait, 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 I wanna go ahead. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. No, no, Papa, you go first. No, no, I was gonna say uh that uh what Fat Prophet just said was key because we were we were uh taught at a very, very young age that this 
place where I am currently residing was our faith. You know what I'm saying? The area we grew up in, just like he said, it was like a prison. You know what I'm saying? So what it was doing, it was teaching us that this is where you're going to be at. And we really didn't understand that. You know, uh, what I've been doing ever since the first, because in here, you know, and, and Deuce know, we, we, uh, we, take, we take pride in celebrating our black history, you know what I'm saying, and, 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 and where our ancestors came from. And so every day here, you know, in a, uh, in a church, we always have, we, we, we watch a lot of uh, uh, black history uh, TV programs and PBS programs and, and Eyes on the Prize and all that. And today we were watching uh, one dealing with um, the Underground Railroad. It went real deep into what the Underground Railroad was really about, you know, because all we really did as youngsters, we scratched the surface, you know, with with a Harriet Tubman and, and everybody, but it went way deeper than that. And so uh, if we sit back and understand that who we are as a people, the power that we have as a people, uh, the electricity that we generate as a people together. Preach. Man, it's, 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 it, this is going to be, and, and I'm going to tap more on this come this coming Saturday in a real Damu love room, you know, I'm a really, I'm a really open up and get real deep, you know, because uh, this is something that, that clubhouse, not only clubhouse, but just in general, what we've been missing, we've been missing that connection of who we are as Damus, Keyways and freedom fighters, because that's all we are, you know? And, 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 uh, and, and so uh, I'm going to go ahead and park it right there. Appreciate that. Appreciate those words of wisdom. Hey, yo, yo, I got a question. Um, so I'm from Compton, right? And, I, you know, Deuce, you already know how I am, man, about the community and everything else. So I'm from Compton, I'm, and I'm down here in Texas right now. So, you know what I mean? I got homies down here, and what are y'all, what are, what are y'all feelings on Texas? I mean, especially with the, you know what I'm saying, the whole Max situation coming out of Texas and all that, you know what I mean? What's the feeling on that? Because it's about the community. So what's your feelings on that? Real spit. I don't care where he's from. We got, to be honest with you, that 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 plays very little part in, when it comes to giving back to your community. No, no, no. Not, so not we giving can't back even... to the community. I'm not saying that. I'm talking about how people like to spin the narrative. You see how, you know, that other dude up in uh, Fort Worth, I, ain't, I don't even speak his name. That clown dude up in Fort okay, Worth, I see um, what you tried to spin that whole Texas Cali thing. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So my thoughts is, you know what I mean. Most of most of the people I know in Cali, they roots is in Texas. You know what I'm saying? Texas, Louisiana, Oklahoma, whatever. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And with this this cat up there, up in Fort Worth, trying to spin that narrative, of, you know, Cali against Texas, and then this happened. You know what I mean? With you know what I'm saying, the stuff that happened in Texas with Mac and then moving back to the West. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. So, so this, my thing this, is like the thoughts on, you know what I'm saying, the whole situation now, you know what I mean, with that information was coming out of Texas and all that. You see feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh uh, well, you know, once again, I I just refer you to the stage. I'll say some names. ODM Slim, Tiny Draws, Blue Strip. All right. So these slim. individual yeah, yeah. Well, 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 if y'all want yeah, to answer so, the question or any any you know what I'm saying, any of the cats from five five. What's that what you say? What you say? No, I'm saying what what was talking about the feelings Hold on, on bro. the information. Can you hear me? Yeah. The feelings on the information, you know what I'm saying? With that whole situation that, that's coming out of Texas, that came out of Texas. You know what I'm saying? Because, like I said, that clown up in Fort Worth trying to spin that whole Texas Cali thing and all of that. You know what I mean? So you then this crap. You, you, you asking how we feel about the nigga from Texas? Or how, how you about, feel about Texas? Texas, period. Te you well, listen, I mean? I, 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 the state Texas niggas, Texas, one nigga can't, yeah, one nigga or a group of niggas can't, can't, can't dictate how we feel about the whole state. You know what I'm saying? That's period. So I fuck with, we fuck with Texas. Nigga, I'm dead. That's, that's one of our stops when we get off this shit. So for sure, we fuck yeah. with, we all through Texas. But my thing is that even that shit, bro. You see me? 
these niggas need help. You know what I'm saying? So, nigga, we, we 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 entertained it. We gave them help. I don't damn how I'm thinking about the same time. Niggas ain't fucking with us, bro. I'm my mama. Hey, and, and, and yeah. I, oh, my bad. Go ahead. Man, Go ahead. Do it. No, I was going to say, like, me doing business. I've been in Atlanta for a while. and I've been influential in the, in the music industry. And what I've learned is niggas fear doing business with West Coast niggas. Yeah. They, I, I mean, it's just, it took me like 12, 13 years to shake off my 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 pain you feel what i'm saying to shake off the rough edges that i came out here with you know what i'm saying it's an adjustment process but um people fear us bro they really they they really don't know how to deal with the west coast person the minute you show any sign of aggression they're gonna shut you out the minute you you know you can't really really be yourself i mean i know our aggression level was higher than a lot of other states i don't know why I think it's just our environment. You feel what I'm saying? We just always on 10. It feels like in other people, in other states, and other places, when you go to do business and handle business, man, they shy away from us so hard. And it takes a lot to to, to shake that off of yourself as you leave the, the you know, as you leave the, the, the core of it. We, we stuck inside of it. When you stuck inside of it, it doesn't really seem like it's that. It's just survival. But when you leave, and you go somewhere else and you around other people, you realize how fucked up we are. And that shit is crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? It's real crazy. For sure. I'm with you. I, I, feel, I, I, I feel that. Like I said, I just ain't trying to have that, have that narrative, man. Like I said, you got that clown up in Fort Worth. And I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I lost enough homies, you know what I'm saying? Worldwide. I ain't even just talking about Cali, Texas, you know what I'm saying? Chicago. I lost homies. So I'm like, hey, you know, let's. My thing is building the community. So if this bring, you know, Cali and Texas to me is like first cousins. You feel me? So I'm just like, what's the take on it? You know, because a whole lot of people listen to that dude up there in Fort Worth is what I'm saying. And they're going to try to spin it. They're going to try to spin the whole narrative about it. You know what I'm saying? But, the, but does he sound any different than any other white supremacist that we came across or any other white man that we come across? He, he has the same no, of course they got. Of course. You got not. the same views that they got. You know, I mean, it's a white supremacist type mentality. You know, it's, it's like, okay, well, yeah, the brother, we, we do have a sickness. Yeah, there is problems, but us just us just putting a highlighter to the world on those problems instead of trying to be proactive and, you know, each one teach one type mentality is, is just talk about it to get your numbers up or to, to improve your self standing or to get into the um, to the daddy seat of the white supremacists in the world. Oh yeah, I'm not, bro, bro, trust me, I'm already on. I just wanted to get the room's take on. You know what I'm saying? That's all it was. I land right there. Can y'all hear me? Yeah, we hear you. I I think uh yeah. First and foremost, that's where my my mom and them is from Dallas and Fort Worth. And I think he killed it when he said one dude don't dictate uh, what goes on with a whole state, right? We don't, that dude's a, a, a pervert. He represents a lot of what's wrong with with us in our community. Uh, calling him out should be our 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 number one pastime. Cancel that nigga up out of our culture. You know what I'm saying? Um, he 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 shows you what self hate really mean he shows you the worst of what's in us so uh yeah we don't really want to worry about the dude with the fucked up eye you know what i'm saying <laughs> he, he don't yeah, really he ain't even he ain't even a he was out here Man, he that's know what I'm about, yeah he was out here he know about this culture he know what yeah. what it do that's why he was spooked when uh the g homies was on there with him online that's why that nigga left. He got spooked. He know what the homie was telling him, you know? Shout out uh, Melvin, man. Melvin exactly. Parker, we had him in the UOD. That's Real a fact. nigga shit. It's on YouTube channel. Yeah, yeah. Um, we got, uh, I'm going to find that link and post yeah, it. Yeah, post that uh, link. With Melvin Shout Parker. out to Ayo Tola Marv, too. He yeah, was on there, yeah, too. Ayo Tola. Yeah. yeah, they pressed him. He said, yeah, always uh, remember this. Always remember this. A clown is going to be a clown. 
That's why he's in the circus. <laughs> yep. Right. Hey, look. He, uh, I want to get that I'm link up and really get into that. I'm kind of busy right now. Y'all just keep proceeding. Give me a couple minutes, man. We got to close. He, uh, he, uh, right, it's gonna, up uh, there now for y'all to hit that link. And check that out. Did y'all see the video of him and Wack going at it? And he said he was shout out Lush Browns and, uh, too. He was scared because uh, he was popping off at the mouth, and he had to call someone because he said he was in different lanes and he didn't want no problems and stuff like that. But Wack told him like, "You ain't gonna come out here popping off at the mouth like you do in Texas out here because uh, they would have made an example out of him." Yep. So, see, look, I, I've been a uh, I've been away from LA for a long time. Uh, but I stay in tune with what's going on out there and uh, the culture. See, the reason that's the main reason why he left is because the culture in L.A. on on both sides, the Damos and the Keyways, that culture is so strong to where when you start to disrespecting the culture itself, it becomes an issue and it's a problem. And he got to get where he got to get. And so, yeah, he was going to be extremely fearful. And I'm not saying that, that the culture in other states aren't the same, you know saying? because it's different wherever you go. But being in L.A. and you disrespecting the culture, uh, he would have, you know, they would have found him on a milk carton somewhere had he stayed longer than what he did. Hey, that's real talk. Hey, dudes, who, they, who y'all talking about that? Charleston White nigga? Man, we don't even want to give him to say his name. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't say his name. We get <laughs> no pr promotion from none of our uh, platform. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just found out about that nigga, man. He had a uh, some interview on Big Facts on YouTube and shit. I don't really know too much about blood, but I heard about him. It's funny because Mom Jays is going to get up in his ass when he's doing that interview. He got up in his face and he didn't want no problems. Well, I think, you know, I think Mom should have just, should have got down, man. Yeah, but he said he didn't come out here, out there to fight that dude. He did not, he just you can't go out, went out there to do you know, it. Some people, with when you see, Every, see, like real talk, it gotta be an example made. I'm not promoting violence, but I'm just saying there has to be part, an example that part, made. That part. <laughs> yeah. uh, 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 the, event, the event they all was paid to be there for was literally for that. It was, to, it was anti uh, gang, anti gang summit talking to kids. So for them to fight would just be like it would ruin actual bread. Mm -hmm. hey, that's, you my that's, that's, that's my issue with these anti things. You know, you, you a, a kid is never gonna learn if you keep on pushing anti this and anti that. You have to educate and teach them. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a firm. I'm, I'm a totally against the anti game culture the anti I don't believe that's 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 gonna be that's the reason why we are in the position we're in right now because it's always this anti this and it's anti that when we supposed to sit back and teach and show why this is not cool why that's not cool because each and every one of us on this app right now in this room right now have went against what our parents told us is what we shouldn't do or anti this and anti that so that you know, and me, I I grew up in a house with Black Panthers. This this is where I grew up at, and so I was taught all these different things. But I was never, my parents never taught me anti this and anti that. They educated me on these things, and so I think that's why that summit that they had, you know, and and I know Mob James real well. I knew I knew quite a few of them people that was on that panel real well. I just don't agree with this anti. I'm gonna call it anti shenanigans. Because that's basically what it is. Hey, can I ask a question? 
All right, hey, going back to uh the Texas thing. Say, man, how do y'all feel about? I'm just curious because I'm in I'm in Texas, right? So when we hear the video, uh, C Mac, you know what I'm saying, singling out Texas like that in the neighborhoods, man. Like, how do y'all feel about that? What did he say? He said, "What did he say?" Yeah. He said that uh, huh? He was talking about the politics was different, right? And then he was saying that the neighborhoods in Texas were like a get along game with the Hoovers. What, what was he expecting though? Like, what was his what was his expectation? I mean, though? that's just what it be. They didn't originate in L.A. Then yeah, what's it's, his it's, that's just what it is. It just really didn't make sense. It's just that's different. Politics is different in different states. But I'm saying, so no, what I'm saying is this right here. So it's okay for you guys to say that y'all politics outweigh our politics, right? For us, like how, how the banging goes, but nobody lived down here with us. Did they even speak on that? No, I don't think it's that. I think I think it's all a jurisdiction. You know what I'm saying? Everybody. Yeah, you can't you can't be worried. How are you gonna be worried if somebody else's politics is dictating your politics? That off the top, you coming from a real insecure place, even thinking on that them lines, bro. No, no, no. I'm asking a question, homie, because look, I'm gonna say this. I, I got put on out there. I lived I, I lived in LA. So I know the politics. And you so know they're different then, I'm right? from Texas. I'm you from Texas. You know they Texas. different though, right? Oh, I know they different, but guess uh, what? I also know I also know some of them down here program the same way. Just like LA. So you, we, we can't say it's all different. Man, I, I, well, I guess I, I'm failing to get because I didn't hear nobody. I, I, I'm I didn't hear any of these individuals like uh, say like um, they was in support of any of any statement like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't think that that no. issue. Go ahead. No, my question was how the whole like what the, the whole Texas thing came about, where dudes went to speaking on it because you know we all. Hey, when we all down here, me being from here, being from Texas, living in L.A. for 14 years and coming back, right? Mm -hmm. So I, I understand. But at the same time, you got dudes feel like, hey, man, when dudes come from Cali down here, we show them love. And then they know they got family down here, right? And a lot of people go out there and visit or whatever. It's supposed to be love. So when they feel like he got singled out, right, you mm -hmm. singled out, oh, the neighborhoods in Texas is get along game with the Hoovers. Like people took offense to that. I'm one of them. I took offense to that because I'm from the neighborhood. I'm from 111. So was, I, I'm like, was, it, was, it, was it was it factual or, or was he making stuff up? But this one I'm gonna say I'm gonna say because we know the politics. If you got an issue with neighborhoods, right in Texas, by him being five five, right? Why not reach out to somebody down here and then speak that instead of putting that out in the air like that? Because that's what? the protocol. We don't supposed to be talking down. Or going to get, you know what I'm saying, saying nothing like that. We all in hood. So why are we going to do that? Why we can't reach well, out? We all networking. Well, I know a lot of homies that's down here. Can I ask you your question things. real quick? Do you sure. consider Do you consider the truth disrespect? Do I consider like, disrespect? Yeah, Do, do it, is the truth ever considered disrespect? No, because it's not the truth. Because I'm not no get along gang, so I know it's so. No, that's not the truth. Well, he all he can speak of. Do you know? All he can speak of is his experience. Like but that's I'm, his experience. Okay, so if I say, it's so ready. I'm gonna ask a question. If yeah. I if I say five five get along gang, what well, I'm not for five five. So how I'm gonna speak on that? I don't know. That's something you. That's like a personal with. thing. That that make yeah. it personal. That's more personal. So him saying they put uh, him in he, he, personal? Nah, he's... Well, first it is of all, because I ain't that gonna was... speak up for a neighborhood crip anyway. I'm not in a position to do that due to my politics. But what I'm saying is, if you had that issue, then maybe one day you'll be able to holler at Crip Mac and address him with that issue or whatever. Uh, but I, 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 I don't know how you could say that. Basically, like he just... You taking it personal. No, like, I'm not it, taking the personal. I'm saying we know the politics. Because, like, look, I you really don't, you can't go around you doing that. It personal. No, you I'm saying, yeah, because, look, I'm from... Hold on, okay, hold on, hold on. So if you're saying neighborhood, right, 
you didn't put no set on it, but we all we all know we neighborhood. So only what's down here. Only thing down this way is 60s and 111. So okay, you didn't put no city on it, but you said neighborhood in Texas. That's a whole Texas. Well, listen, man. Well, I, I don't think he's think he's he's hey, 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 Tony, how old are you, Tony? Look, homie, I'm not trying to score. No, I'm just Tony. How old are you, Tony? What does that matter? We talking. It does matter. How old are you? We just trying to get some context, brother. Okay, so what's so what's up? I'm older than everybody on the panel. What's up? Okay, so you still care about that? No, I don't right. care about that. But I'm All saying, right, then. So what we talking you about? Know. Come you on, not, man. Get, get, get out of here. <laughs> no, 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 wait, 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 wait. No, How do we know you're older than everybody on the panel, no, though? I'm going to care about this. I got yeah, he just that made an assumption. So we should be mad no, about I what he just said. How, well, how old are you, Tony? <laughs> let me let me tell let me let me let me you uh, young buck. Let me tell you real quick. Yeah, you ain't uh, the oldest, so you was ignorant making that statement. But go ahead, big homie. Let, yeah, well, well, first of all, you know, my age, I love my age. I'm 55 years old. Um, I've been I've been, I've been gang banging since I was nine years old. Uh, I'm sitting in the penitentiary right now, and in this penitentiary I'm in, it's cats from all over. It's a few cats in here out of Texas. And you got to understand this about politics. Every region you go to, matter of fact, matter of fact, I'm gonna go deeper than that. Every city you go to is gonna deal with politics differently. If Crip Max said something that was offensive to individuals or groups of individuals, neighborhoods, whatever the case may be, you got to understand he's speaking from a poor, uh, a place that's going to build his politics up. You know what I'm saying? Because he'll speak, he may speak negative about my politics. I may speak negative about his politics. Politics is politics. You know what I'm saying? It's never going to be agreed upon on how politics is going to play in these neighborhoods. I don't believe one politic is greater than the other. What I do believe in is the individuals that are politicking, do they know what they're doing? You know what I'm saying? Everybody is not a politician. You know what I'm saying? I'm a politician because I was forced to be a politician. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want to be a politician, but I was forced to because of my circumstances and my last circumstance for the last 37 years. You know, but if if you are offended by the way someone represents their politics, then that means you have an issue with your politics. And that's what you should look into. You should look into how you feel about politics, period. You know what I'm saying? Because if he don't have it, because I'm like this, I'm a Damo and I, like I said, I've been banging since I was nine years old. If someone's politics don't interfere with my politics, I can, I can care less. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to always tell a person, man, if you feel your politics better than mine, more power to you. I'm going I'm to I'm give you that and let you push on. You know what I'm saying? Because I want you to feel good about whatever it is you push. You know what I'm saying? Because as long as you feel good about what you push, I feel good about fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? So you just got to understand politics is going to be just what it is. Politics. You got to beat that defense now. Get along, gang. Get along, gang. You gotta beat that. But you, hey, when you singling that, but when you singling shit out, come on now. We, we're gonna talk real. You just gonna single something out? Like, you can't really be doing that. And then expect not to nobody to feel, look at it, or see it a different way. Right? And he was down here. So when you was down here, what what neighborhood you was down here with them dudes? Why you didn't speak on them? Just that, not just everybody. Can we say he didn't? That's not, that's that not, to that's them? not, that's not dodge the wordplay.